grace and peace from our Lord Jesus Christ be with each one of you this morning. Let us prepare our hearts and sing the Lord in His temple. Psalmist says, Lord, our Lord, how majestic is your name in all the earth. You have set your glory in the heavens. Through the praise of children and infants, you have established a stronghold against your enemies to silence the foes and avengers. When I consider your heavens, the works of your fingers, the moon and the stars which you have set in place, what is mankind that you are mindful of them? human beings that you care for them. 诗人说,耶和华,我们的主啊,你的名在全地何其的美,你将你的荣耀彰显于天,你因敌人的缘故,从婴孩和吃奶的口中建立了能力,使仇敌和报仇的闭口无言。我观看你指头所造的天,并所
at me. I see the stars, I hear the mighty thunder, that far throughout the universe displayed. Then sings my soul, my Savior God to thee, how great thou art, how great thou art. Then sings my soul, my Savior God to thee, how great thou art, how great thou art. And when I think that God his Son not sparing, sent him to die, I scarce can take it in, that on the cross my burden gladly bearing, he bled and died to take away my sin. Then sings my soul, my Savior God to thee, how great thou art, how great thou art. Then sings my soul, my Savior God to thee, how great thou art, how great thou art. When Christ shall shout of acclamation and take me home what joy shall fill my heart then i shall bow in humble adoration and then proclaim my god how great thou art then sings my soul, my Savior God to thee, how great thou art, how great thou art. Then sings my soul, my Savior God to thee, how great thou art. How great thou art. Let's con continue uh, standing as we give uh, praise to God. Praise the Lord, all my soul. Okay.
是我的国，饭也离我多远。耶和华有怜悯的爱，却有丰盛无尽的恩典，从亘古直到永远。耶和华。我的心，我的心，你要称颂耶和华，不可忘记他的恩惠。孩子的命里写的过去一年，因此你疾病敷衍。我的心，你要称颂耶和华，不可忘记他的恩惠。他一人来慈悲为你宽免，为出去的人伸冤。是我的国，繁也离我多远？耶和华有怜悯的爱，且有丰盛无尽的恩典，从亘古直到永远。耶和华他是我的神。慈爱耶和的一生，动力是有多么的远，他是我的国，繁也离我多远。耶和华有怜悯的爱，却有丰盛无尽的恩典。从亘古直到永远，耶和华他是我的神。Amen.、Uh, please be seated. 请坐。Now we hand over the time to、uh, Pastor Chu and Miss Chu. 我们现在把时间交给邱牧师还有邱师母。呃，感谢神，我们今天能够在一起，在一起敬拜他。啊、uh, ，We give thanks to God that this morning once again we are here together to worship the Lord。啊，特别欢迎啊，讲传到呃扩泰的家里的人。啊、uh, ，We special welcome to Pastor Kotai's family。好。啊，今天我要与大家分享的主题。The theme which I'm going to share with you this morning. 就是在基督里生根建造。That is rooted and built up in Christ. 那也是我们今今年我们教会的年题。And this is the theme for our our church this year. 让我们看今天所要思考的经文，就是在哥罗西书的二章六节到七节。圣经说：“你们既然接受了主基督耶稣，就当遵他而行，在他里面生根建造，信心坚固，正如你们所领的教训，感谢的心也更增长了。”啊 ，Colossians two six to seven. So then, just as you received Christ Jesus as Lord, continue to live your lives in Him. Rooted and built up in Him, 
strengthen in the faith as you were taught and overflowing with thankfulness. Paul reminded the the members in the church in Colossae. After they received Christ as their Savior, so they have new life in Christ. And Paul used a tree to uh, describe this life. We know that a tree must have roots. They are to. They have roots as a tree. Then the roots can grow and become strong. Then only the the tree can grow and become strong. Similarly, we in the church life, we can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. Same thing in our life. We can grow and become strong. So what does the roots of the trees do? What are the function? What is the importance of the roots to the tree? First, so the as uh, number one, the roots has to be strong. So that Roots is like the foundation of the tree. Then, that tree, that tree, the 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 so the the most important thing is the roots that is uh, enable the tree to stand in the wind and the storm. So it's very important. We know that the roots are very important for a building structure. So the foundation is very very important to a structure. Now you see two pictures here. You see two pictures here. Okay, this tower of Pisa is about 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the uh, 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th century. And this tower of Pisa was built in the 12th What is the question? Why is that tower is wide? Why is that tower is a little slanting? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is that Wan Li Chang Zhen still so strong? Why is That's why it is going gradually. It is slanting down. But the Wan Li Chang Zhen's foundation is strong. But the foundation of Great Wall of China is strong. Now I want to give a quiz for someone. For for you. We know that this is this is the building is called Pisa Tower. 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 Oh, this was built by a rich man. This rich man had a neighbor. And he, or this rich man, had a neighbor. He was also a rich man. We know that the rich man was a rich man. We know that the rich man was a rich man. We know that the rich man was a rich man. We know that the rich man was a rich man. So as neighbors, you try to compete with each other. So the second rich man was a rich man. We know that the rich man was a rich man. We know that the rich man was a rich man. The second neighbor looking at the 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 villa, and he fell in love with it. He just went to the builder. Then he asked the builder, "Can you help me to build one too?" Can you help me to build one too? 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 
So after the completion of this, the first uh, rich man's villa, he, the builder went to the second rich man. So he, this, uh, construction started to look for some development. So after the discussion and all, then they started uh, building the um, in foundation. the foundation. And the first man thought, "Hey, you're doing what?" Then the rich man came and asked him, "What are you doing?" I'm building this villa for you. What are you doing? I am building this villa for you. What are you doing now? What are you doing now? I am building this villa for you. What are you doing now? He said, I, am, I have to build a strong foundation. Now my question comes, I listen carefully. Then the rich man said, I don't want this, I just want the third floor, the third floor. But this rich man said, I don't want this foundation, I want only the third story. Okay? What will you do if you are the builder? Yes, you know. Pardon? Sorry? <laughs> I didn't get him. Didn't get it. Sorry? sorry? <laughs> oh, so you said never mind? <laughs> never mind is your answer? <laughs> It's your funeral. It's funeral. It's like you're gonna die if they don't have a funeral. Okay. Now, what about others? So, if I were the builder, I would pack up and walk away. 就是说，如果我是建筑师的话，我就那一天停止，把我所有的工具拿掉离开。为什么 ？Why? Why did the builders walk away? Why do you think the builder walked away? It's no strong foundation. Because how can you build a house without a without foundation? Without a foundation, how can you build third floor floating in the air? You understand? Okay. So the problem is just that the lead is that we cannot build a house without a foundation. So the, we cannot build a house without any foundation. 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 And also, the Bible has、uh, described our life is just like a building. 就就好像一棵树，那个根那个根是多么重要。Just like the roots are so important to the tree. 一栋楼那个根基也是重要。So to a building, the foundation is very very important. 所以这里就是圣经怎么样形容我们的生命，就像一层楼。So this is how the Bible、uh, describes our life as a building. Here, Luke 福音的第六章四十七到四十九节，耶稣说：“凡到我这里来，听见我的话，就去行的。我要告诉你们，他像什么人？他像一个人盖房子，深深的挖地，把根基安在磐石上，到。”滑大水的时候，水冲那那房子，对吗 ？All right， 我要<笑>房子总不能摇动，因为根基立在磐石上。唯有听见而不去行的，就像一个人在土地上盖房子，没有根基，水一冲。随即倒塌了，并且那房子也坏得很大。So it says here in Luke chapter six,、uh, as for everyone who comes to me and hears my words and puts them into practice, I will show you what they are like. They are like a man building a house who dug down deep and laid the foundation on rock. When a flood When a flood came, torrent struck that house, but could not shake it, because it was well built. But the one who hears my words and does not put them into practice 
is like a man who built a house on the ground without a foundation. The moment the torrent struck that house, it collapsed and its destruction was complete. Here, Jesus tells us that He is a man, He is a man, He is a man, He is a so Jesus tells us here he is the rock and he is the foundation in our life. There are two types of foundation. Number one is the foundation which the world provides for us. Secondly is the foundation which Jesus has for us. Let's see the difference of these two found foundation. So what is the world foundation? For everything in the world, the lust of the flesh, the lust of the eyes, and the pride of life comes not from the Father, but from the world. So this is the foundation which the world gave us. So, so it is the lust of the flesh, lust of the eyes, and pride of life. So, as children, you may not understand what is the lust of the flesh or lust of the eyes. But we can learn from the temptation of Jesus like what is the meaning of the lust of the eyes, lust of the flesh, and uh, the pride of life. So we have heard this story in the Sunday school. So after Jesus fasted for 40 days, he was hungry. So Satan then the Satan came and tempted him. He said, You are the son of God. So, in other words, you are omnipotent. You can change these stones into bread and you can eat. So, it's really just so. So the tempter came to him and said, If you are the Son of God, tell these stones to become bread. We know that So this is how Jesus replied to Satan that man shall not live by bread alone. Okay, we know that today, so in order to survive, not only food we need, we need other things. What was the first temptation of Jesus? So something which we can see with our eyes. Uh, hear with our ears. Something which we can smell. Something which we can touch. And something which we can taste. So we have these five senses. But oftentimes,就是世界上会引着我们有这个五个不同的感觉，它来引诱我们或者吸引我们做那些事。so very often the world or Satan used the world because through these five senses to, uh, to tempt us to do the things that are not pleasing before God. So this is what? This is the 
肉身的情欲。Just like the lust of the eyes and the flesh. 就是说，今天很长，我们因着我们看见的，我们要，然后我们就犯了罪。And it's very often it's because what we see and we want it, and this is how we fall into temptation. 耶稣第二个试探是什么 ？What is、uh, Jesus' second、uh, temptation? 就是魔鬼把他放在天顶上。叫他跳下来。So、uh, Satan asked him to go up to the pillar and to jump down from there. 他说：“你跳下来的话，神会差遣他的使者天使拖走你，使到你的脚不可以垫到石头。” Telling him that if you jump down, the God will send his angels to, ah,、uh, to so that to,、uh, to hold you so that you will not strike against any stone. 这当然就是今天。如果你跳，你如果从一个高楼大厦跳下来的话 ，So if you jump down from a tall building， 我们知道有地心吸力 ，And there is that the gravity there。OK， 如果你跳下来，到要地哪里先，你不颠到地，你再浮在哪里，等于你好像地心吸力再不能够控制你了。So that you are caught in the air like。And the gravity have no effect on you. Okay, so 变成什么？你会变成一个成功的人或者成名的人。So you become very、uh, popular. Okay, 所以这里就是第二个，第二个试试探就是神。I mean, 魔鬼很常用什么？用这个成名来怎么样？来试探我们。So very often, Satan used this like、uh, for fame, just to, to become famous, to,、uh, to tempt us, so that you become popular. You want to become a great man, and you become someone that is、uh, great. You want to become a great man, and you become someone that is outstanding. You want to become a great man, and you become someone that is outstanding. And you want to be、uh, popular so that everyone can recognize you. 这是什么？这是今生的骄傲。And this is called the pride of life. 第三就是耶稣，那个魔鬼把耶稣带到一个高山上，把世界的荣华富贵给他。And the third temptation is how Jesus,、uh, how Satan led Jesus on top of the mountain and show him the the world. 告诉他，如果你拜我的话，那我就会把这一切、权柄、权力给你。Telling him, if you just have to bow down to me, all this will be yours. 但是耶稣说，只要你要敬拜神。But Jesus said, you will only bow down to the Lord your God. 现在世界也是用什么？用这个 power， 用这个权势来吸引我们。So in the same way, the world is also using this prestige and power to attract us. 是在我能够去管理他的人，去制服他的人。So that we become someone who is influential to take control of others. 所以这里我们看见到这个是世界的根基。Here, this is the foundation of the world. 世界上的人追求什么？追求能够满足我。五种的这种感觉，我的眼睛，我的耳朵，我的我所尝到的、摸到的东西。So the people in the world, we are seeking for some that、uh, can satisfy our five senses. That something which is tangible and something which we can see with our eyes. 或者我们去世界上告诉我们，我们去追求什么？追求我们的名誉、名望。So we are looking for. Power and prestige in this world. 还有那个我们的这个这个权威 And to become someone ah、uh, great. 这个就是世界的根基 And this is the foundation of the world. 耶稣是的根基是什么呢 ？Well, what about the foundation in Christ? 我们可以用一节圣经来解释 We can use one ah、uh, verse to explain this. 耶稣说：“我就是道路。” Jesus said, "I am the way and the truth and the life." 
所以耶稣这里告诉我们他的根基有三点 and in this journey, there is always the starting point and the uh, uh, finishing point or the destination. Okay. And in this journey, we will experience different, uh, different things or events in our life. And we learn lessons. 或者一些苦难, we have we face with hardship. We face with heartache, joy. And also there are times of celebration. But God promise us in this life's journey. Under any kind of circumstance, God promised to be with us. Because Jesus said, I am the way. Uh, here, this is his promise. When you pass through the waters, I will be with you. And when you pass through the rivers, they will not sweep over you. When you walk through the fire, you will not be burned. The flames will not set you ablaze. There is a Chinese saying. 好头还是好尾好? To have a good beginning, better, or to have a good ending? Okay, 中国人说的话很重要. So sometimes the Chinese saying is very, very important. 好头不如好尾. So it's better to have a good ending than a good beginning. 我们今天每一个人都在这个 这在这个旅程中, on so this journey. Each, every one of us is here on this life journey. 你会告诉我, Can you tell me how did we start? 你决定吗, Can you and I decide? No. 但是更重要的就是, so the more important thing is, what is our destination? That is the ending point. And what is the direction that we are heading? This is what Paul says. He says, I have died and am so this is what Paul says, for I am already being poured out like a drink offering, and the time for my departure is near. I have fought the good fight, finished the race, Kept the faith. Now there is in store for me the crown of righteousness, which the Lord, the righteous judge, will award to me on that day. And not only to me, but also to all who have longed for his appearing. Here Paul says, I know what is my end point. So it is very, very important. How did we start is not that important. The most important thing is we can take control of 
where is our de destination oh. or where we are heading? Yes, uh, but Jesus said, I am the way. The second Jesus said, I am the way. The third point, he said, I am the truth. Here, the Bible tells us that he is the way. He said, I am the truth. 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 He said, I He says here, the Word became flesh and made His dwelling among us. We have seen His glory, the glory of the One and Only Son, who came from the Father, full of grace and truth. Today, we know what is truth. So, so you know what is truth. Actually, when the human being in this world has a beginning, a history. So from the uh, early part of the history of mankind, we can see that human beings are searching for this truth. And men have been searching for this truth. This truth is what? So what is this truth? It is I who is who. That is the question we ask: Who am I? We can see that in human history, many people are searching for this truth. We can see that in human history, many people are So we see in the history of mankind, everyone is seeking the answer to this question: is who am I? If today you find the answer to this question, then you have found the truth. So if you find, are able to find the answer to this question, that means you have found the truth. If I ask you, who are you? Who are you? If I ask you this question, who are you? You say, "I am this name." You tell your name. My father and mother are this name. And this is my parents' 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 Jesus tells us, we are not children of blood. Okay, 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 we are not children You are a monkey. If you believe that you are from the monkeys, that means you are a monkey. Okay. Now, the Bible tells us that we are created by God. So the Bible tells us very clearly that we are created beings of God. He says, "God created us from nothing." 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 This is what the Bible says that God created man in His own image, in the image of God created him, male and female created He them. Okay, so we are today what? We are God created His own image, created us. So we are the beings, the created beings that is created by God in His own image. Okay, so we are the created beings that is created by God in His own image. Okay, so we are the created beings that is created by God in His own image. Okay, so we are the created beings that is created by God in His own You are the children of your father and mother. You have many places that are like your father and your mother. In some areas, you are like your parents. Okay. Today, the Bible says that God created us in His own image. So the Bible says that God has created us in His own image. So the Bible says that God has created us in His own image. So the Bible says that God has created us in His own image. So the Bible says that God has created us in His own image. So the Bible says that God has created us in His own image. So the Bible says that God has created us in So, in other words, there are there should be areas in our life that we have the likeness of God. In this scripture, I have a very interesting question for you. Okay, for you to think. Okay, children. I have a very interesting question for you. Okay, for you to think. Okay, children. It says over here, God created him, created he him, male and female. Okay, after his own image. Now my question to you is: Is God masculine or feminine? 
Yes. But then he said, after my own image, I created male and female. No, you think about it. Okay, don't answer me so fast. <laughs> All right, Liam. Okay. Liam have raised his hand. Yes, yes, Liam. What kind of boat? His kind of kind boat. of boat. So God is not he, God is not her, and God is shim. <laughs> anyway, all right. I don't want to confuse. Her. No, all right. So these are some of the thoughts you guys should think. So yeah, anyway, it's already uh, translated. Okay. <laughs> All right, so just remember, we cannot use our experience and knowledge to imagine how God is. We cannot. Okay, God is beyond us. Just remember that, okay? So there is a lot of, lot of argument on this, whether God is masculine or feminine. But here, very clearly says that if God is feminine, how can he create female? I mean, if God is masculine, how can he create female? female okay all right so that's just a thought for you guys to think I don't want to uh, make it that uh, so complicated okay so so we are created in God's own image not from monkeys not evolved from monkey all right the second point about us it says so the second point is for all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. So if God has created us, we should be like God that is, who is holy. But what is the difference that God has given us is that freedom of choice that is different from all the other animals. And because of this freedom of choice, we chose to uh, drift away from God and we also fall into sin. So the Bible tells us we will we will die one day. Okay. 死了以后, you sin pan. Sin will sin pan woman. And after that, there is judgment. So when God judge us, there are two places for us to go. Either heaven or hell. 但是神为我们预备了 There, there, it's working. Oh, sorry. Okay. Then, here we tell us, So the Bible tells us that the wages of sin is dead, but the gift of God is eternal life in Christ Jesus our Lord. 2,000 years ago, more than 2,000 years ago, Jesus was the Word who became flesh and dwelt among us. So on the cross, He went, He shed His precious blood and redeemed you and I from our sins. Just like John 3.16 says, that God so loved the world that He gave His only Son for us that whoever believes in Him will not perish but have everlasting life. And this is the gift that God has given to us. That if we believe in Jesus, then we are saved from our sins and we receive this eternal life. Third point is Jesus 
is our the life. 我们的生命有三方面。There are three areas here. 我们有肉体的生命。The physical life. 我们有这个灵灵魂的生命。Our spiritual life. 还有我们有永恒的生命。And the eternal life. 今天让我告诉你，神创造我们是这样奇妙的。So it is so amazing. And how amazingly God has created us. 这里诗人说，我的肺腑是你所造的，我在母腹中，你已经覆庇我。我要称谢你，因我受造奇妙可畏。我的你的作为奇妙，这是我心里深知道的。So this is how the psalmist says that. God, you created my inmost being. You knit me together in my mother's womb. I praise you because I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Your works are wonderful. I know that full well. We know one very powerful physicist called Newton. There is a famous scientist by the name of Newton. Do you know Newton? Do you know Isaac Newton? Okay. What's so great about him? Yes. 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 Yeah. Christine, <laughs> you wanted to answer. Sorry. Oh, same answer. Okay. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Now, but you know, even today, Einstein theory has to be modified. But his theory of gra gravity still not modified. Okay. So how great was he? Anyway, now you know what he said. Something. You know what Newton said. Something. 他说 ，If I look at my thumb， 他说看我的这个大拇指，我就知道我的创造者的伟大。So he said something just by looking at his thumb, he can imagine how great is our God who created him. Imagine today you do not have your thumb. What if we are without a thumb? How much work your hand can do? Without a thumb, so so many things we cannot do. Okay, that's how God created us so wonderfully. And this is how wonderfully and amazingly God Sorry, has I'm created. Sorry, I'm speaking English now. Got I? I have the same problem. I'm translating the same thing. Okay, <laughs> 好，所以 Newton 说，如果看我的拇指，我就可以看得到。我的神的奇妙，我的神的智慧。This is what he says. Just by looking at his thumb, he can experience God's greatness and wonderful acts. 你们喜欢不喜欢剪手指甲 ？Do you like to cut your nails? 喜欢。我不喜欢。我说很费事哦。但是。如果没有手指甲，你的一枚针叠在地上，你怎么样剪？当然，你会说我用磁铁剪。但是，如果你没有磁铁，你怎么样剪 ？It is so. Yes. Do you do with your hand with a? No, I said without nail. How are you going to pick up the needles? Oh. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Good. I'm glad you are interacting with me. It means you are not sleeping. <laughs> okay, good. All right. So, we see that God created us. We are wonderful. We are wonderful. Okay. So, it is so wonderful. God has created us. And we are living. Jesus said, "I came to give you life, and more than life, 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 more than life." Jesus said, "I have come to give you life, but..." To the fullness of that. 换句话说，他会使到我们灵命丰盛。So in other words, he wants to enrich our spiritual life. 就是我们的思考、我们的感情等等，就是他说我会使到你们更丰盛。That is our mind, our emotion, 
our heart. 并且我们也看见到，我们的灵是不会死的，是永恒的。So this soul of ours will not die; it is eternal. 就是说，神为我们的肉体的生命、灵魂、灵命，还有永生或者永恒的生命。这里就是耶稣，他告诉我们，他说，他告诉他的门徒，你们心里不要忧愁，因为你们信上帝。在我父家里有许多住处，我去是为你们预备地方去。我预备好了就回来，教你们到我哪里去，为你们预备的地方。This is how abundantly God has created for us, not only for our physical life, it is also for our spiritual life. That is in John 14:1 to 3. Please, English. Okay. All right. Uh, I would not... like you to read it along with uh, Mrs. Chiu. All right, please read it together with me. Do not let your hearts be troubled. You believe in God, believe also in me. My Father's house has many rooms. If it were not so, that I am going there to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come back and take you to be with me. That you also may be where I am. He promised that if you believe, oh sorry, 他允许我们，如果你信耶稣的话，他为我们预备在天上有住处。So what Jesus has promised us that if we believe in Jesus, He prepares a home for us in heaven. 到时候我们会在永远永恒里面，就是那个永生与。住在一起。Then we are with the Lord in eternity. So here we can see that Jesus said, "I am the way." That means he created us, this body, that life. So this is the life that he has created for us. And he has given us life to the fullest. So this is the life that he has created for us. And he has given us life to the fullest. So this is the life that he has created for us. And he has given us life to the fullest. So this is the life that he has created for us. And he has given us life to the fullest. So this is the life that he has created for us. And he has given us life to the Eternal life for us. Now, we are deep in the ground. 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 We are deep in the That is to do according to His word. 第二，我们要信心坚固。And secondly, to be strengthened in our faith. 第三，我们要受教训，领受教训。Thirdly, it is teachable. 第四，我们要有感谢的心。And number four, to have a thankful heart. 所以这里我们看见到，我们在主里面，在神的话语里面，我们要生根。So we have to take root deeply in the Word of God. In the Word of God. First, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Second, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Third, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Fourth, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Fifth, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Sixth, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Seventh, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Eighth, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Ninth, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Tenth, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Eleventh, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Twelfth, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Thirteenth, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Fourteenth, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Fifteenth, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Sixteenth, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Seventh, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Eighth, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Ninth, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Tenth, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Eleventh, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Twelfth, we have to allow the Holy Spirit to guide us. Fourteenth, we have to Secondly, the world will pass, but the word of God will last forever. Thirdly, we should allow the let the word of God to mold and shape us. And fourthly, we should be thankful to God that He has given us His word. We now have to look at three words. Uh, we are going to look at these three great uh, men of in the Christian history. Okay. And their life has laid a great influence in our uh, belief. Augustine And Augustine was a great theologian. And some people compare him with Paul, Saint Paul. We know Paul. He influenced us. We know the whole 
uh, 信仰。And Paul has a great influence in our belief. 他也是像保罗一样影响我们的信仰。Uh, Augustine is also like uh, Paul. Augustine 还年轻的时候，他是一个很放荡的青年。Uh, Augustine led a very uh, sinful life, and he was uh, as a young man. He and a wife together had a like a son. And he lived with a woman, and they had a child. Okay, not married. Okay, the cohabited. Okay. 他一直过很放荡的生活。So he led a very sinful life. 有一次，他看见一群小孩子。So one time he、uh, saw a group of children. 他们在唱一首诗。And they were singing. 英文是 pick it up and read it, pick it up and read it， 就是捡起来，然后读。Ah,、uh, so that was the song, pick it up and read it. 当他听见这句话的时候，他好像神教他。你要去读圣经。So when he he heard this song, it seems like God is telling him go and read the Bible. 后来那天他就打开圣经。So that day he opened the Bible. 圣经在这里，他看见神的话。And from the word of from the Bible, he saw the word of God. 行事为人要端正，好像行在白昼，不可。放烟醉酒，不可好色邪荡，不可增积啊，增进嫉妒，总要披戴主耶稣基督，不要为肉体安排去放纵情欲。See, so this is the verse that he read that day. It says in Romans 13, "Let us behave decently as in the daytime." Not in carousing and drunkenness, not in sexual immorality and debauchery, not in dissension and jealousy. Rather, clothe yourselves with the Lord Jesus Christ, and do not think about how to gratify the desires of the flesh. This text has made a drunken Augustine into a 跟随耶稣基督神圣的一个信徒。So this particular words has transformed this young man who led a sinful life into someone a great follower of Jesus Christ. 另外这个人叫做马丁路德。The other one is Martin Luther. 我们知道马丁路德，他是宗教改革的一个神的仆人。He was、uh, the reformer of that.、Uh, Reformation. Reformation. Today, we are also following his example. Only with faith, only with the Holy Spirit, only with the Holy Spirit. So this is what he says: that only、uh, go to the English. Yes.、Yeah. Only faith alone, grace alone, and Scripture alone. Today, we are following the example of God's grace, faith, and the Holy Spirit. What is the Holy Spirit? So that is the、uh, grace of God. And his word. So, one time he went to Vatican, which is Rome. So, one time he went to Vatican. That Rome had a, at that time, had a place called the Holy Stairs, which is the Holy Stairs. So, that that time there was、uh, something very famous called the Holy Stairs. This Stairs is when Jesus Christ was on his way to Jerusalem to be executed by Pilate. He was on his way to Jerusalem. And that was the stairs that during the time when Jesus was uh, was uh, tried by Pilate, and Jesus was walking on those stairs. So, how did he get from Jerusalem to Rome? We don't know. We don't understand how did the stairs、uh, move from、uh, Jerusalem to Rome. But, 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 at that time, people believed that if I climbed this stairs, my sin, my guilt, would be satisfied. So the people at that time they believed that if we just have to climb these stairs up, and then our sins will be forgiven. So here you can see Martin Luther was climbing the stairs. So you can see in this picture Martin Luther was climbing the stairs. He suddenly felt that something was wrong. Then suddenly he realized there is something wrong here. If I climb the stairs, my sins will be forgiven. Then Jesus stopped the crucifixion on the cross. What did he do? 
So if I just have to climb these stairs and then my sins can be forgiven, then what need of Jesus to die on the cross? 然后,圣经里这句话就是使到他生命得到改变. So this particular words in the Bible have enlightened him and his life was transformed. 使到他明白唯有信心,唯有恩典, so he was able to understand that only faith by faith, only by grace, and only by the word of God. Uh, this is Romans 1, 17, says, for, the gospel, for in the gospel the righteousness of God is revealed, a righteousness that is by faith from first to last, just as it is written, the righteous will live by faith. 好, so we're going to look at the third person. Uh, Charles Spurgeon. So he was a very, very uh, famous preacher. Yingwen, he was a prince of preachers. He was known as the prince of preachers. So they are uh, 5,000 people can be seated in his church. So he was a pastor in that church for 22 years. So he wrote many books and we can read them. How did he get saved? How did the word of God transform his life? When he was at the age of 15, so he walked to his church to, uh, for worship. But there was a great snowstorm. So in order to get some shelter, he went to a nearby, uh, a smaller church. And the attendance was very thin that morning. So for the first time, he went to that church. So because of the storm, uh, snow, even the preacher, uh, the pastor did not show up. So they were all waiting for the pastor to show up. So But finally, the chairperson, uh, they, uh, they read it. I mean, he read this verse. Okay, this person is out. He opens the Bible and reads this verse. And this is what he read. He said, "If the first person is looking for me, I'll be there. Because I'm God, there's no other God." He says, in Isaiah forty-five twenty-two, he says, "Turn to me and be saved, all you ends of the earth, for I am God, and there is no other." That guy, the priest. The chairperson read one time. He saw that door. Did he come in? And he was looking at the door, expecting the speaker to arrive. No one came. The speaker did not arrive. He read the second time. Then he read for the second time. Did the speaker come in? Did the speaker show up? No one came. No. He read the third time. For the third time, he read. No one came. The speaker did not show up. So he shut the Bible. And that was the end of the service. Spurgeon So at the age of 15, Spurgeon was saved on that day because of this. Turn on to the Lord, and those who turn on him shall be saved. So three months later, uh, he, he accepted the Lord and also uh, baptized into the Lord. So I would like to encourage uh, you, the kids, to read the Bible. So this is my encouragement you to all to read the Bible. You say, where to read the Bible? 
Let me tell you, I started reading the Bible from here. So this is how we started reading the Bible from the daily bread. Now in those days in India, we don't get the current one. We get all the old ones. They use it, they send it to India, we use them. Okay? And so I started doing my daily devotion, reading the daily bread. And today I look back, I thank God for daily bread helping me to have set time every day to read God's Word. There's a scripture verse, there's a scripture passage you can read, and the short message. I hope before the service is over, you can take one home. Begin today, June the 4th. Start reading your devotion. Okay? All right. How? Open Jeshachi. Khan. 我们要在神的什么神的话语里神的道里面向下扎根 So we should be deeply rooted in the word of God 接下来最后我们要在神的爱里面扎根 And also deeply rooted in the love of God Are you a loving person? Are you? Yes Now this is what Jesus said, So this is how Jesus wants us to show our love. So that Christ may dwell in your hearts through faith, and I pray that you being rooted and established in love, may have power together with all the Lord's holy people to grasp how wide and long and high and deep is the love of Christ and to know this love that surpasses knowledge that you may be filled to the measure of the fullness of God. Let the love of Christ fill our hearts. What kind of love Jesus said, if you love those who love you, what reward you will get? Are not even the tax collectors doing that? We should love those who are the uh, the untouchable. Okay? Let's see how Jesus loved. He loved the lepers. And it is, uh, leprosy is contagious. But he touched them and he healed them. So it's not uh, important to the little children. 但是耶稣说, 你们不要阻止小孩子到我这里来. So Jesus said, you should not, uh, you should forbid not the children to come to me. 耶稣为着那些跟着他三天的人,预备什么,预备五饼,二一给他们吃. And Jesus prepared for five loaves and two fishes, for those followers who follow him for the past few days. Because he had compassion on them, knowing that they are hungry and tired. So we Jesus is telling us to love the unlovable. The untouchable. Okay, 然后当我们见主的时候, so that when we see Jesus face to face, so what will he tell us? 他说, 我饿了,你给我吃,我渴了,你给我喝,我坐客里的时候,你留我住,我车身入体的时候,你给我穿,我病了,你来看顾我。So the 
this is how it says, Come, you who are blessed by the Father, take your inheritance. So, for I was hungry, and you gave me something to eat. I was thirsty, and you gave me something to drink. I was stranger, and you invited me in as I needed clothes, and you clothed me. I was sick, and you looked after me. I was in prison, and you came to visit me. So these people say, when did we do such things? So Jesus said, whatever the least that you do among the brothers, that you have done that to me. Okay, can you tell me what is this picture? Yes? Where? Where? Where, is it? Where are the Twin Towers now? This is oh, New York. Uh, Twin Towers gone. They're terrorists. Okay, so this is New York. This is the Twin Tower before 9-11. It happened in 1977. Mm -hmm. So this incident happened in July 13, There was a blackout. And that was the blackout. 25 For 25 hours. You know blackout Okay? Okay, so you two people live in a hundred floors. So the, there were two people who were up there on the... Not up there, down there, down here. <laughs> How many, okay, down here, okay? Did you say you paid? <laughs> no, their offices are in 100th floor, okay? Okay, it's, it's understood. <laughs> so there were a lot of looting going on. So there is so much chaos down there because of that uh, blackout. So one of so one of them said, I have the keys to the office. So we can at least climb up and then it is safer there. But to climb that stairs for uh, minutes. So we can still make it. We go for snacks. Okay. Snacks. We go for snacks. Okay, the snacks. and then slowly we go up. So it's 20, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, <laughs> but the keys are left behind in the car. So what are you going to do? Jintian, look at you, Tian. Woman, light out Tian Tang the Munko. So if we are at the entrance of heaven to the one day, woman, may you, yes, okay, woman, I got yells, Jinchi. If we are without that key from, Jesus, from the Lord Jesus, what are you going to do? So, what is your foundation today? Is it the foundation of Christ or the foundation of the world? Let us pray. Father, we thank you this morning we can gather together and worship you. Thank you, Lord Jesus, that you are the way, the truth, and the life. And if in you, Lord, we can come boldly to the Heavenly Father who has created us in your own image. We thank you, Lord, that only Jesus, you are the rock and you are the firm foundation whom we can build our, and our life and we can trust in you because Lord you never change the world will pass away but your word will never fail we give thanks to you 
It is our prayer, Lord, that each one of us will learn to put our faith in you and help us, Lord, to read your word so that because your word is a lamp to our feet and a light to our path. It is your word that is leading and guiding us so that we will lead a very purposeful life, pleasing and acceptable in your sight. Help us, Lord, not only be hearer, but teach us, Lord, to apply what we have heard from you this morning in our lives, that we will please you, we will honor you, and we will love you and serve you faithfully as we live each day for you. We thank you and we praise you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Pastor Chu and Ms. Chu, for sharing the Word of God with us. So in response and also uh, prepare our hearts for the Holy Communion, let us sing, Jesus, keep me near to the cross. Jesus, keep me near the cross. There a precious fountain, free to all a healing stream, flow from Calvary's mountain. In the cross, in Till my rapture 
接下来是圣餐礼拜，欢迎每一位在座的弟兄姊妹，受了洗、见了新的，欢迎跟我们一起来守这个圣餐，代表耶稣基督他定十字架所剩留下所存钱的救赎。Our worship service followed by Holy Communion. We invite and welcome each and every one of you who has been baptized and confirmed to join us in observing the Holy Communion. In the spirit of gratitude and thanksgiving for Christ, His love manifested on the cross. Because He died for us, today we can come and celebrate this uh, uh, Holy Communion, uh, these sacraments, uh, with the heart of uh, gratitude and thanksgiving. Okay? And in order to prepare our hearts, let us read the scripture. Uh, when, uh, 首先,请让我们读圣经来预备好我们的心 okay? We shall read it in English together okay? And prepare our hearts Alright For I receive from the Lord What I also pass on to you The Lord Jesus on the night He was betrayed Took bread No, sorry Sorry, took bread, okay, right. And when he has given thanks, he broke it and said, this is my body, which is for you. Do this in remembrance of me. In the same way, after supper, he took the cup, saying, this cup is the new covenant in my blood. Do this whenever you drink it in remembrance of me. For whenever you eat this bread and drink this cup, you proclaim the Lord's death until he comes. So then, whoever eats the bread and drinks the cup of the Lord in an unworthy manner will be guilty of sinning against the body and blood of our Lord. Everyone ought to examine themselves before they eat of the bread and drink of the cup. For those who eat and drink without discerning the body of Christ, eat and drink judgment of themselves. Thank you. Okay, so scripture is very clear that we are gathered here to commemorate and also to remember and also to give thanks to our Lord Jesus who died on the cross to save us from our sin and the whole sp the sole purpose for him to come to this world 2000 years ago is to accomplish this plan of salvation for you and I when he died on the cross to repay or ran pay the ransom of our sin okay the bread is a symbol of his body that was broken for us when he suffered scourges on his back when he the crown of thorn was plunged into his bra his hands and feet were pierced by nails and his side was pierced by the spear and this cup represents the blood that is shed for us when he died on the cross and the bible says without shedding the blood there is no remission of sin so when we look at the bread and when we look at the cup, we look at the cross where Christ died for you, show his love for you and I. So each time when we come at God Lord's table, we should come with a gratitude heart, a grateful heart. We should thank God for dying for my sin. Okay, then again Paul said, that you and I, before we partake the Holy Communion, we should reflect, we should confess our sin, because if we still harbor sin in our hearts, we receive the Communion, 
receive the sacraments, we violate the body and the blood of our Lord Jesus. So there will be a time for you and I in the stillness of this sanctuary. Let Holy Spirit speak to us. Let us confess our sin. We ask the blood of Jesus to cleanse us before we receive the sacrament. Okay? 再次我们感谢神我们来到主的台前感谢主舍身流血的大爱我们知道这个饼代表耶稣的身体为我们受的偏伤枪伤还有禁忌的伤他的被代表耶稣基督的宝血在十字架上为我们舍得成全的这个救
you have healed us of all our illnesses. We thank you and we praise you in Jesus' name. Amen. We request all of us who have been baptized and confirmed, please stand. Ching. Solo shi chen na ti chung zi men chi li. Hao. Ling dao bing yi ho. Ji shi. Zai zu de mian tian mo dao. Deng ho. As we receive the bread, let us continue to stand before the Lord, waiting on Him, giving thanks to Him for His immeasurable love manifested on the cross. You say, Mei Ling Sada Ping, Chin Jisa, anyone? did not receive the bread, please raise your hand. Oh, Bun Xiang, Bun Xiang. Okay. All right, good. Are this is my body, which is broken for you. Do this in remembrance of me. Kanshini,的保鞋,穷十字架上留下来成为,赎罪的强言, Amen. As we wait on the Lord, receiving the cup, continue to give thanks, waiting on Him. How? You say, May you link the pay, Ching Chiso.
Jesus said, this cup is the New Testament in my blood that was shed for many for the remission of this, of sin. This do in remembrance of me. Tianfuman 使得我们每一天都能够为主而活荣神一人十字架十字架永是我的荣耀我从罪多洗净洁为靠耶稣宝血请坐请坐 oh, uh, welcome each one of you to join our worship service today. Also, once again, uh, welcome Pastor Kota and Florence and also the dad and Chris and family. So, uh, the announcement, uh, oh, sorry, uh, let's read the scripture for this week. 我们来练本周的金句. Second Timothy chapter 1, verse 7. For the spirit God gave us does not make us timid, but gives us power, love, and self-discipline. Okay, the announcements for this week is that uh, on June 10, which is this coming uh, Saturday at 3 p.m. at Markham Chinese Presbyterian Church, we will be having a Thanksgiving service, and also we invite each and every one of you to join us. There will also be a book launch on that day as well. We in New Year's we will and also please note that next week which which is June the 11th after the worship service we will have a love feast so please register with uh, Mrs. Chen, and uh, adult will be ten dollar, and then children twelve and under actually will be uh, five dollars. 然后六月十一号，主日崇拜之后会在办公室里面举行一个的爱宴，你可以向陈李月华姐妹来报名，每位是十元，小同学二岁以下是五五元。And also uh, the next one will be this year the summer camp will be held at Shalom by the Lake on July 14 to the 16. The theme for this year uh, is Together We Grow in Christ, and the registration is $80 per person. Children under 12 will be uh, 40 But also know that actually uh, we have reached the limit. So instead of the cutoff day on June the 18th, after today, there won't be any registration. But we still welcome Day Tripper. <laughs> 主题是在基督里一起的成长成员是八十元小童十二岁以下是四十元我们现在已经是很多人来报名了所以我们会今天已经是节持了大哥的一吃但是我们欢迎每一位可以是你当天的去就是只是
一天的去参加，一天参加的话，每位是二十元。Okay, and finally, uh, the last one is that the VBS for this year will be held from August the 21st to the 25th. So we encourage you all to register. Children and youth in the age group 4 to 17 are all welcome to join. The registration has started. So uh, if you, uh, I mean, register with Paul, registration fees is $100. So just to give a heads up, they will be a one day field trip. So we also welcome the parents to join us. Uh, more detail will be given later. 我们今年八月二十一号到二十五号会举办这个暑期的圣经班，欢迎年龄介乎于四岁到十七岁的青少年和儿童参加，每位是一百元。然后啊，他的报名日期是五月的二十一号到六月的三十号，请上古德欢弟兄啊来报名。然后在这里的新啊有一天会有一个是啊一个的 field trip， 我们也欢迎做父母的可以一起来来参加。Okay, let, uh, let's all stand for the doxology and uh, request Pastor Chu for the benediction. We Praise God from whom all blessings flow. Praise and all creatures to the name. Amen. Shall we receive God's benediction? May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, fellowship and the communion of God the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. 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 Uh, please be seated. Please. We'll see you all next week.